crocodiles are the king of reptiles in our world. This mesmerizing yet terrifying creature roaming on this planet for millions of years. You will be astounded by knowing that crocodiles are here from the ancient period of the dinosaur. Yes, you heard that right. They survive through every hazard and natural disaster, and yet ruling the soil as well as the water of this world. Those thick, mighty killing machines have super surviving ability and are pretty much strong to defend themselves from any of the mammals or reptiles. Today, we are going to tell about such five crocs, those are unknown to science. Number five, Two-Toed Tom. The Two-Toed Tom, or known as the Demon Gator, or Tom, was a threat for the people of the Florida-Alabama border. This is a real story from the Southern United States. A giant, terrifying alligator kept people in fear for many years in the time of the 1900s. The croc or the alligator was known as Two-Toed Tom. It is because once he was caught in a trap built with a net of steel. He managed to break the trap and escape, but he lost it all but his two toes. As per the evidence and native citizens from the area, Two-Toed was not an ordinary alligator who normally roamed around the roads and pond sides of their garden. It was pretty much bigger than any other gator they had ever seen, and the most horrifying thing was the fact that his eyes were fully red and his size was something that made people fear him the most. Almost 32 feet long with a mouth as big as a human. Just imagine an alligator that size roaming and checking you out when you are walking in your garden alone. Tuto Tom or the Devil Gator had the reputation of ripping horses in parts. One day, a farmer named Billy from the area went to the backyard of his house to check and feed the horses. When Billy opened the horse dome, he found something that made him faint on the spot. Later, Billy described after entering the dome, he saw three of his horses are standing in fear and one of the horses is missing. He found a leg of the horse on the end of the dome, which indicated a line of blood gone into the pond. Pap Haynes was one of the neighbors of Billy. His fear turned into rage and decided to kill the monster at any cost. So he, with his sons, planned a trap on their pond with horse meat and shoved in some grenades on the side of the ponds. But their plan failed miserably. Some of the neighbors believed that the devil gator was no ordinary reptile, but it was sent by the Satan. Number 4. Ocean Croc Crocodiles are known to be the reptile mainly rivers and lakes. Ocean crocodiles are extremely rare these days and hardly one can find a croc roaming around on the beaches. When we talk or discuss giant crocs, it is mostly about the crocs from the rivers significantly from Africa. But now we would like to present you the giant crocodile from the ocean. Yes, you heard that right. It happened on the beach side of Queensland, Australia in 1957 or 1958. A hunter who was out there for fishing saw something unusual coming towards him. As per his statement, it was like a giant torpedo with spikes on it. He shot the croc without any second thought, but the crocodile did not die, but luckily those gunshots were enough to divert its mind and he turned around and went vanish within seconds like a submarine. The hunter was shocked and stunned from what he saw. After this incident, some of the hunters gathered and decided to kill the crocodile as they were convinced that the crocodile was the reason for not getting enough big fish. According to the hunters, it was as long as 28 feet with a very dark skin shade which made the beast more horrifying. One of the fishermen told the local police that one day when he was fishing on his boat, nearly at the hour of lunch, he saw a shark was running fast from something. He could not believe what happened next. Out of nowhere, a pair of jaws came out from the water and grabbed the shark inside their jaws. Within seconds, the shark went vanish while its blood made that part of the ocean look like a red kingdom. Another creature that was classed in the following classification is the Ambon Sea Serpent, a monster seen near the northeastern coast of Africa that related a caiman but was enormous with a fin on its back. Another potential colossus crocodile is the U-28 creature reported to be found at North Atlantic during World War I. This one was reportedly 60 feet long. Number 3. Guma Monin This is the kind of monster people do not want to live with at all. According to the researchers, this reptile is the cousin brother of the Nile crocodile and also has a connection with the monitor lizards of the Nile. 
Though many others claim that these giants are the remains from their dinosaur brothers, Guma Monin had a serrated ridge on its back with its color being grayish brown. They were often discounted as Nile crocodiles. There are several reports of Guma sightings in Africa. Officially, it was seen for the first time in 1961 and after that in 1971. Yes, after 10 long years, it appeared again in front of people for the second time. But there is an unofficial report of Guma sightings. An old fisherman from Dongu Mataba claimed that, while he was fishing on the nearby river, he saw a creature come up from the water. It was about 100 meters away from him. It slowly crawled on the ground and kept his head low, seemed like it was waiting for something. Suddenly, to his shock, the creature grabbed a young buffalo, and with its immense power, it took the buffalo into the water. Anyway, the second time it was seen by a biologist named Roy P. Mackle from the University of Chicago found the beast when he was in search of another kind of reptile in Le Koala Swamp Kings. He saw a creature like the Biulu, but it had a smaller ridge than Biulu, though the shape is almost the same. The local people narrated that a hippo was killed by the horrific giant in front of three or four people, but there were so many marks of wounds, and all of us know how powerful a hippo is, so it gives a clear idea about the terror and strength of that giant reptile. If Guma Monin is a monstrous brother of the Spinosaur family, this discovery would be amazing. Guma Monin also reported being quite related to the early land animal Synapsid Demetrodon. It has also been said that it may be an elongated member of the Varanidae family, which I have mentioned before, the monitor lizards. Number 2. The Gator Man Have you ever watched The Suicide Squad? Remember a guy who looked like a crocodile standing as a human? Yes, right. I am talking about the killer croc. Well, that must be from the comic, but those kinds of mutants may be lurking somewhere outside. Yes, fortunately or unfortunately, the reptilian humanoid is a real thing according to eyewitnesses from a different area. According to the report, the first sightings of the reptilian humanoid occurred in December 1973. A family was out for a long drive on the National Highway in Florida. The father who was driving saw a man with a hoodie on, slowly walking on the sideline of the highway. He felt curious because normally nobody walks on that road and it was scorching heat. On a hot temperature like that, nobody would dare put a hoodie on. When he got close to that person, he saw something supernatural that made him numb. He saw a human-shaped creature with scalded skin. It was greenish-black and the eyes looked yellow and not like the normal human eyes. It was much bigger than average human size and seemed like water was coming out of its mouth. The terrifying creature looked into his eyes and he got frozen for the moment. But it did not take any action and kept walking. The witness looked in the rear mirror if it was coming or not. Then he saw it just cross the road and went vanish in the jungle. Another incident that occurred in 2016 at Louisiana when a woman with her child was going to her mother's house and that is when she witnessed the beast. According to her statement, when she was driving, she saw a human with a very weird and reptile kind of skin with scales on it and some sort of small ridge was located on its back. However, she could not have a clear view as the creature quickly went far from the highway. Number 1. Mahamba Mahamba was the kind of crocodile people always search for. The Bobangi aboriginals were lucky or unlucky enough to have encountered the giant. They named it Koli, which means giant reptile. Some crocodile researchers said it could be the cousin brother of the crocodile from the ancient time. Another group of people said that they could have been the freshwater relic of the ancient giant Mosasaurus that lived in the Cretaceous period and we all presume the giant to be extinct. The Mahamba was approximately 45 feet long with a gray blackish skin color. An artist named David Miller illustrated the giant crocodile for one of Roy P. Mackle's documentaries. The Mahamba had the reputation of devouring rafts and canoes. A group of tourists from Europe went to the Congo for research purposes. On the Maya Dombe province, they took a canoe to cross the river of Salonia. After passing through half the river, they felt a giant rock hit their boat. The sailor of the boat was well experienced and he knew what the danger could be. He sailed the boat as fast as he could. In the meantime, the boat got hit again and this time it was hit by the monster's tail. One of the eyewitnesses described that it looked like some sort of huge water dinosaur because of its size and immense power. 
They somehow managed to cross the river without the boat getting destroyed. The sailor then explained about the havoc. He said it was Mahamba, the big bad brother of a crocodile, and it does not like any boat to run on the river. One of the ladies from the aboriginal group told the visitors that one early evening she went out to the river for collect water. She was done taking water, then suddenly she experienced a huge splash on the water, and the next scene that occurred on her eyes was a big buffalo was stuck between a pair of the jaws. A humongous pair of jaws locked the buffalo's head and grabbed slowly into the water. She was stunned because that is not any normal crocodile's jaw. And most of all, crocodiles do not attack giant buffaloes of that size, and even if they do, they cannot take them. The wild world out there is pretty much mesmerizing, yet horrifying. We love to see beasts with enormous energy and gigantic size. That is why people like crocodiles so much. Sometimes they become the predators we fear in our dreams and make life hard for the humans living near them, though often we are the ones to be blamed for breaking into their area. This crocodile species monstrosity seems mere to our next predator, hiding deep into the icy waters of Alaska. To witness the ultimate monstrosity, click here.